What's up, my homie, homies, and fellow NFT collectors? My fellow VV content creator, VV Vibes, who you can follow on YouTube, has put together a website where you can rank the Disney Golden Moments by tiers. So I thought I would do my ranking on a video and let you guys see how I ranked them and why I ranked them in that way. I'm going to link the website and the original tweet in the description. So if you guys want to fill out your own Golden Moments tiers, you can reply to VV Vibes' tweet as some other people are doing and let us know how you ranked them. This is the website that it links to. You can see there's uh, five tiers already there that starts with S at the top and then A, B, C, D. And you can actually add tiers. I'm going to add one more tier. And we'll call it E tier because I'm going to need at least that many. I might need another one at the end. We'll give it its own color by going into the settings. We'll use light blue. Then we're going to rank all the Disney Golden Moment NFTs from top to bottom on what we think are the most important ones on the app. So starting off, of course, I'm going to put the partner statue at the S level, the superior level. That's going to be number one. And there's probably not going to be another one to match it. And the next ones we need to look at are going to be the Star Wars NFTs. You got R2-D2 and you got C-3PO. And there are half as many R2-D2s as there are C-3PO. So I feel like they need to be separated. Whereas R2-D2 is the next level down. But C-3PO should be a level down from it. So I'm going to give them all their separate tiers here. Now I do have some uh, sources pulled up. I'm looking here at a study that was done a couple years ago about the most popular Disney cartoon characters ever. Of course, Mickey Mouse is number one. Then you got Donald Duck at number two, most popular ever. Then we got the genie from Aladdin. And then we got Sebastian of the Little Mermaid, which is important. Then we got Lion King, but that's Simba. You got Goofy. And then there's Timon and Pumbaa right there from the Lion King. They're up there in the top ten. Stitch, Olaf and some other people that aren't Disney go to moments. Then I got the highest 15 grossing uh, Walt Disney movies ever, and number one and number two are both Frozen movies, so keep that in mind. Elsa's gonna have to be high on the list, and then Lion King's up there as well. I don't think there's very many other ones on this list that are Disney go to moments. And then I also have the highest grossing media franchises of all time. Of course, Pokemon is number one, Hello Kitty, then Mickey Mouse and Friends, and Winnie the Pooh, and Star Wars is up there. Disney Princess is down here in the next level, along with the Marvel Cinem Cinematic Universe. Dragon Ball, Transformers, Barbie, there's Batman, Toy Story, and Cars. So let's keep all that in mind. There's The Simpsons right there and The Lion King as we go through and make our list. All right, the next ones I'm going to look at are going to be Elsa and Iron Man, which I think are pretty even with each other because they're both super important characters. They're also both NFTs that have over 10,000 additions. So in my mind, they go up here with C-3PO. So I'm going to put both of those there at the B level. And then I want to fill out the bottom level too, so we have a little bit of a range here. And I'm personally going to be putting Wally at the bottom, along with the NFTs from Beauty and the Beast. All right, I think uh, the Simpsons NFT is a little underranked or undervalued by a lot of people. And that it should go all the way up here with Elsa and Iron Man because it was one of the it was the first Disney drop, and it's also signed on the bottom by the artist. So I'm gonna have Homer and Bart here in the B tier, and then we got Donald Duck here, which we saw in one of those most popular Disney cartoon characters studies, was top on the list, number two. So I feel it's in this B tier range also. All right, checking to see if there's any more that I want in the B tier. We're gonna put Winnie the Pooh in the B tier. You can see that was one of the highest grossing uh, media figures of all time. And next up, we're gonna fill out the C tier with Timon and Pumbaa, which is in the Lion King. That's on a couple of those lists. And then we're gonna go ahead and put Sebastian and Flounder up there because they were listed as one of the most popular Disney characters. They're from The Little Mermaid, which is a very popular movie of all time. There's Sebastian right there. And I think that one's really underranked right now as far as prices on the VV Marketplace. All right, next up, we're going to go with a few things to add into the D tier, which would maybe be Lady and the Tramp. And I'm going to go ahead and put that Pixar truck here. It could possibly go down to the E tier, but it does have half as many additions at only about 6,000. So that what's, that's what knocks it up to the D tier for me. All right, next we have all four of these rare NFTs down here. These are all low edition NFTs. The skateboard is from the Simpsons drop, which was the first drop ever. In my mind, these don't quite match up with the C-3PO's or the Elsa's or the Bart and Homer's. To me, they're going to sit here in the C range, all four of them. 
So if I had to fill out my Disney Golden Moments tier list, this is where I'd be right at right here. I've got the partner statue by itself at the top, and then R2-D2 is in a class of its own there at the second tier. And then at the third tier, I've got C-3PO. We got Iron Man, Elsa, Homer and Bart. We got Donald and Daisy Duck, and Winnie the Pooh, which is an iconic character in Disney. C tier, I got Timon and Pumbaa, uh, Flounder and Sebastian, the skateboard from The Simpsons. We got the magic hat, which is pretty expensive in the uh, app right now, and it completes the set with Elsa. But with it just being a hat, I don't feel like it reaches the same tier as Winnie the Pooh and C-3PO. And then I got the Chipmunks here, which is a rare NFT, an ultra rare NFT, which bumps it up to C tier for me. And the Avengers logo also. And in D tier, I got Lady and the Tramp. And then we got the pizza truck from the Pixar movies. And E tier, the bottom tier, I personally have Wally. And then the characters from Beauty and the Beast. So that's my tier list right there. Like I said, I'm going to go ahead and link the original tweet in the description of this video. And I'll also link the website so you can make your own tier. And feel free to reply to this original tweet with a picture of your tier and show everybody how you ranked the Disney Golden Moments. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you at tomorrow's drop. Later.